Narcissists are multifaceted individuals with a wide range of characteristics, abilities, and traits that are both attractive and harmful. The most dangerous narcissists in our lives frequently lurk in plain sight because they are unable or unwilling to see above their own consumptive self-absorption. We must develop the ability to recognize the telltale signals of a narcissist and break the cord before they poison our well-being in order to reduce the negative consequences that these selfish people have on our life. Understanding yourself and the manner in which you can be deceived and controlled by a narcissist is the first step in comprehending the narcissist. With this information at hand, it is simpler to identify the various narcissistic personality types and stop their self-destructive conduct before it may consume our happiness from the inside out. Narcissism, what is it? Narcissism can be defined as the inclination to think highly of oneself to the extent where respect and compassion for others are lost. A narcissist is someone who is self-centered, conceited, and fixated on receiving praise. They are the center of attention at all times. They view people as little more than throwaway tools to further their own objectives and view them as accessories. The narcissist is toxic and harmful. They are nevertheless all around us. In general, narcissists are grandiose individuals who lack empathy for those around them and who also exhibit arrogant, self-absorbed, needy, or manipulative tendencies. They must be in charge and seen as superior or in charge in order to be in control. These behaviors are frequently the result of deeply ingrained fears and problems brought on by childhood trauma. The most dangerous narcissist subtypes. There are numerous varieties of narcissists, and not all of them are the same. These self-obsessed megalomaniacs range in toxicity in their relationships, with some being more deadly than others. Knowing the most hazardous narcissists can help you avoid them more in the future, allowing you to set boundaries that will help you safeguard your heart and peace of mind. The Narcissist in Hiding Not all narcissists are overt with their manipulative self-obsession, despite the fact that the traditional perception of narcissists frequently pinpoints a certain grandiosity. The covert narcissist is someone who subtly exalts oneself above others, losing themselves in a calm smugness that enables them to denigrate others as boring or dumb from afar. It's crucial for the covert narcissist to keep their conceits hidden when it comes to their behavior. But as you get close enough, you'll realize how shallow the waters actually are. The Narcissist Who Is Sexual The sexual narcissist is one of the most harmful types of narcissist. This person is an expert manipulator who uses emotional and physical abuse to sate their own sexual appetites and need for ego validation. The imbalances that sexual narcissists create in their relationships, as well as their persistent transgression of boundaries, as well as the repeated abuse and neglect of their victims, are what distinguish them as sexual narcissists. Blatant Narcissist Unlike the hidden narcissist, the overt narcissist enjoys loudly and publicly lording their superiority over others. They are the kind of person that comes to mind when we hear the word narcissist, and they are also one of the easier types to identify. The overt narcissist never backs down from a put-down or excessive display of self-importance because they enjoy nothing more than haughty disdain and excessive, blatant manipulation. The Narcissist Who Uses Evidence Not all narcissists develop in that way from a young age. For some people, developing a narcissistic personality comes after achieving a certain level of notoriety, position, or public recognition. Although these people may have begun life as kind, sympathetic individuals, over time they develop the belief that it is appropriate in both social and professional contexts to exercise their ego in a domineering manner toward others. The Narcissist Who Is Passive-Aggressive Some narcissists exhibit passive-aggressive behaviors in an effort to gain the approval and power they crave. Verbal aggression, aggressive humor, and even accusing, waiting, and making excuses are all instances of this type of behavior. Because they are experts at subversive sabotage, passive-aggressive narcissists are so harmful to our welfare. 
negative consequences of narcissistic abuse. The negative consequences of having a narcissist in our lives are numerous and seriously detrimental to our sense of self. All narcissists destroy our self-esteem and make it difficult to remain in the present moment. It is possible to overcome these negative impacts, but it requires awareness of the damaging habits that keep us constrained, afraid, and accepting less than we deserve. Self-loathing. Humans want for connection, yet those who are self-obsessed hardly ever manage to make it happen. Those who are at the mercy of a narcissist frequently look for forgiveness by giving up their own self-esteem on the altar of the other person's inflated ego because they are unable to satisfy their innate desire for affection. These thoughts like if I were a little quieter, they would love me more or if I change myself, maybe he'll finally love me quickly become into internalized beliefs. Restricting oneself. Extremely sensitive or sympathetic individuals frequently try to minimize their presence in the abuser's world by shrinking in response to narcissistic abuse. This is a learned behavior that they carry with them throughout their lives, and it is particularly damning when it's necessary to defend yourself and the things you need. The victims of narcissists struggle to find their own voice in a world that is defined by someone who can't see past their own selfish goals, much like the fabled nymph Echo, who was forever destined to remain a shadow in narcissists' existence.